Welcome to Moo Moo Math and Science. In this video, you will learn how the lymphatic system helps keep you alive. The lymphatic system absorbs and transports lymph. Lymph is a clear fluid that is the result of plasma leaking out of capillaries. As plasma moves out of capillaries, some of it is not reabsorbed. You lose around three liters of this fluid a day. The lymphatic system reabsorbs loose fluid. If you look at this cross section of a tissue, you can notice how the lymphatic vessel is located near the vein. Once this plasma that is leaked out of capillaries enters lymphatic vessels, it is called lymph. Lymph also includes protein and cellular debris, which are too large to be collected by veins and capillaries. The lymphatic vessels have smooth muscle and valves that help move the lymph throughout your body. Once lymph enters vessels, it is then transported to lymph nodes that act as filtering stations in your body. In the lymph nodes, cells from the body's defense system called lymphocytes help fight bacteria and viruses. These nodes are located throughout your body, including under each arm, your hips, and in your abdomen. Lymphatic tissue is also found in other areas of your body, including the tonsil, spleen, intestinal wall, and bone marrow. So how does the lymphatic vessels keep you alive? Lymph nodes are responsible for filtering lymph and provide part of the immune response. Lymphocytes found at these nodules help fight the pathogens that are in your lymph. Also, if these three liters of blood was not returned to the blood vessels, you would have a drop in blood pressure and less oxygen would be delivered and less removal of waste. The tonsil, spleen, and lymphatic tissue found in your abdomen are additional checkpoints that look out for disease-fighting pathogens that have entered your body. The lymphatic system also helps with the absorption of fats and fat-soluble nutrients in the digestive system. The lymphatic system has special small vessels called lacteals that are responsible for taking up fat and fat-soluble nutrients. So there we go, the lymphatic system, the blood collecting system. Thanks for watching and Moo Moo Math uploads a new math and science video every day. Please subscribe and share.